We do word associations for people. Yeah. Things. Urban. Love it. You say it's wired differently. <laughs> I know. Complex. How so? Um, style. Just style. Straightforward. Straightforward. Tunnel yeah. vision. Yeah, he had the ability to compartmentalize. I mean, it's just unbelievable. Um, Brian. Uh, high EQ. High football IQ. Urban. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. On the surface, that seems to be a no-brainer. He was available. It's a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer. Uh, but did you have any concerns about hiring? No, no. We we talked about the issues that you know people were concerned about the mm-hmm. behavioral issues that flowed all that, and no, I. I were concerned about it, and, and uh, you know, every leader is different, and you know, and he was wired differently, and so I, I was, I felt comfortable managing that that personality, and, and I love him to death. Uh, and then you took a shot at hiring Ryan. Oh yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. No yeah. national search. I mean, this is yeah. obviously a premier job, and you yeah. said this is the guy. Yeah, I mean, I mean, he's he's different, and, and then Urban was right. Uh, so which is probably good. That's right. right. And we didn't need we didn't have an environment where, you know, you need to blow up the system. Right. You know, and and so it was all about investing in Ryan and helping him develop into the leader that he is today. You know, I mean his football IQ obviously was no brainer. And I think over the what, five years now he's developed into this unbelievable leader and and uh, you know, was never a head coach, and, uh, and you learn, you grow. You, we need to be Michigan. You know, we need to be in the Big Ten championship game and win the Big Ten championship because that was something that we were consistently doing. Right. We got to get back to that. And the, and the national championship is paper thin, particularly with the new playoff system. So none of us know how that's going to roll. Right. Uh, but we got to win the Big Ten championship, and, and so he knows that. And you know, it's you know this. It's poker chips now. I mean, it, in my tenure, my last act, um, you know, I, I I approved a lot of things to put us in position to yeah, hopefully do that. Yeah. And um, you can talk about that, but yeah, I, you know, I, I, the I, salaries are easy here to talk about. Yeah. And I approved all those salaries. And, oh, the and, coaching pool. Yeah, coaching okay. pool and to put Ryan in a position where he's a CEO. Which is where yep. he needed to be, right. and, I, yeah. and all the chips are in on that one. And yeah, we're probably if not number one. We'll be number two when Georgia's and LSU's yeah. numbers come out. But um, in salaries, and, and I'll let you talk about it. I am. Okay. What do you feel your legacy is? Uh, you know, it's the people, Bill. I, I, don't know, I think uh, the legacy is the culture uh, within the athletic department among the people, and the culture among the student athlete population. And that's it. Um, you know, you know, that's really what I feel it is. You know, any major regrets? No, no, I don't. You know, I uh, I wish I had, uh, you know, had a, an opportunity to you know, win more football championship or whatever. But you know, it is what it is.